Coach, uh, coming off of a 3-1 defeat against 7th ranked Columbus State, first of all, uh, just your thoughts on how your side performed today? Uh, you know, I, I didn't think we played our best soccer. Uh, they're a very good team. Uh, they deserve to be ranked uh, seventh in the country. Uh, uh, you know, obviously we had won our last two meetings here against them at LREMC, won in overtime last year. Uh, they're a very, very good team. And when you play them, they're going to have the ball the vast majority of the time. You have to play Leicester City style, sit in, score on the counter, and win the game that way. I thought when we drew the game level at 1 1, they, they, we got sort of sorted out. But, uh, you know, uh, we, we, we just, that, that was not our best. And uh, ultimately, that falls on my shoulders. Um, you know, we, maybe we've, this is an unusual year. We play one game a week and we train a lot. Uh, we played a game obviously earlier in the week, maybe, maybe, and I'll have to, you know, reflect on that. Maybe we trained a little too much. Maybe we just didn't have enough, uh, you know, in our legs, and, and that's on me. So I think the players have to do some self-reflecting uh, as well as the coaching staff, and we're going to take two days off. Uh, we are not going to train before our next game. Uh, we're going to have a short meeting on Saturday, but we're, we're going to take some time off and let our bodies recover and, and clear our heads a little bit and, and get right for uh, Sunday's game against UC Aiken. And you mentioned their ability to really control the ball and pass it so well. How does that change the way that you are at least hoping to play? How does that impact the way that you Well, you have to sit in and, and you can't chase the ball, which, uh, you know, is what we did when we beat them in the conference tournament championship in 2007. Uh, I think they had 24 shots in that game and we had five. Uh, you have to know when to press the ball. We sit in and you have to know what angles to take away and what ball to win. And I think we we, we pressed a little bit uh, when we didn't need, didn't need to press and we didn't win some entry balls that we have been very good at winning in the past. We don't chase, we sit deep, we win the ball and we counter through our number nine and we get our 7-11 high on the pitch and, and, and create a three on three versus their back three. But we were unsuccessful in doing so uh, today. And again, ultimately, that's my responsibility. It falls on my shoulders and uh, I'll, I'll go back and look at the tape. I'll look at how we trained leading up to the game. But but uh, the way we played today, the way I, I managed the team today, just isn't good enough to play uh, and win against a, a quality team like Columbus State. Definitely one of the bright spots today, uh, today, Zion's first goal of the season. What did you see on that goal? Well, Zion is always uh, somebody who is uh, there. She's very opportunistic. She's very athletic. Uh, and I mean, those are the kind of goals you're going to score against Columbus State. Uh, you know, put a ball in the box. Uh, there was a little bit of a pandemonium in the box and she stays with the play and ball lands at her feet and, and, and she finishes. I thought at that point that we were back into the game. Um, I will just uh, agree to disagree with uh, the penalty that put Columbus State up 2-1. I quite frankly thought that was a free kick going our way, but, but again, I'm not the referee. Uh, and, and we didn't lose the game because the referee, uh, the game plan wasn't good enough. And, and again, that falls on me. What do you hope the team takes out of today's match? Well, I think, uh, you know, my takeaway is that we are good enough to beat a team like this. Obviously, we've proven that multiple times in the past. We just have to understand how to beat them. And, and the way we play today and the way we coach today as a staff is not the way to beat Columbus State. It, what, what we did today, quite frankly, wasn't good enough. But I think we know what to do. We just didn't do it well enough today. So, you know, uh, there are some positives there. Uh, I look forward to potentially playing them again in the, uh, in the PBC tournament. Awesome, Coach. Thank you for your time today. Thank you.